On the working visit to Stockholm, Sweden, Minister of Public Works and Public Housing Basuki Hadimuljono made several meetings. One of the agenda was the signing by Basuki Hadimuljono and CEO of Swed Fund International AB Maria Hokansen at the Indonesia Embassy in Stockholm, Sweden on Wednesday. The signing attended by the Indonesian ambassador to Sweden and Latvia, Excellency Kama Pradipta Isnomo. The principle of environment-based and sustainable infrastructure development are indeed a commitment of the Ministry of Public Works and Public Housing, and one of them is through the development of waste management through the use of refused derived fuel or RDF technology, which makes waste a source of renewable energy. The cooperation involves Swed Fund International AB, which provides grants to finance feasibility studies or other technical assistance, and the Minister of Public Works and Public Housing through the Directorate General of Human Settlements. The application of this technology was built in the east of the Kebun Kongok Landfield Complex on an area of 7,000 meters square owned by the Mataram City government with the processing capacity of 120 tons of waste per day. Now, from this capacity, it is estimated that it can process around 40.19 tons per day to produce 15 tons of waste that has been processed for RDF, which is utilized by the Jeranjang Steam Power Plant. Ronnie Bisono and Anwar reporting from Stockholm, Sweden, for today.